calling this meta text because you're going to be linking things in your actual text documents. First thing I'll show you though is how to insert pictures and text wrap. You've gathered your pictures, you've saved them to your Google Drive. If you click insert image, that will call up your Google Drive. And from there you just need to browse to where you've saved your pictures. Again, if you haven't already gathered your pictures, you want to do that first so that when you go to the insert image menu, you can just browse to where they're saved. I'd advise saving them into a folder where your documents are, but anywhere is fine. Pick your image, select it, and it'll come in very big, the full size of the image, probably too big. I would click wrap text first. There's a little link below the actual picture called wrap text. And that will cause your document to put text around your picture. Then you want to grab the corner of the, doc of the picture in your document. Uh, don't grab the edges, top or left, right, or bottom. Grab the corners, and that will keep the proportions correct. And then you can move that picture wherever you like in your document. Now, for linking text, you want to actually link to external websites that you reference in your document. You also want to link to other documents in your project. First thing you need to do is share that folder. So put all of your documents you've made for the project into one folder and then share that with your teacher. You can share this with other people too. If you have a partner, you could put their name here as well, but at least share them with your teacher. Once you do that, once you do that, then you'll see that you have a link at the top that you can actually share. You can copy that link and that is where you'll get the magic of linking multiple documents together. And see that link at the very top? Highlight that, and then if you copy that, you'll have that to put into your documents. We're going to save those changes so that we have our shared folder. So everything in that folder now is shared. All the documents you've created in your project, all are shared with everyone that you've picked. You can open up any document now, and it's a shared document. Uh, first thing we'll do, though, before we link your documents is you may have text you want to link to external sites. You might have sources or websites or web pages that you want to reference in your project, and when you click them, it will actually take you to those sources or that site. You saw that example just now. I already have one linked there. So how do I get that link? Well, first off, you need to choose the text, the words that you want to actually create that link. Highlight those words. It can be a single word or more than one. Once you've highlighted that, there's a little link icon, insert link, and that gives you a spot to put the link to whatever it is you're referencing. So then you have to go to the actual place, either your document or the external site. Once you're on that page, highlight the address, copy it, once you have that copied, take that over to your document for linking. And then paste that in the link box and then apply that. And so that then becomes a link. When someone clicks it, it will take them to that source or that external site. And you can do this multiple times throughout your entire document. So then your documents, you need to link and interlink all of your project documents. How do you do that? Uh, I removed one I had already. I'm going to highlight that text to my other document for causes. And then I'm going to insert link. But then I have to go to my document, open it, make sure I have the right one, and then click the share button. And because I've shared this already, there's a link there waiting for me to copy. I can copy that link to my clipboard. And once I've copied that, I can go back to my document where the link will be and paste that address to my shared document. It's a long address and click apply. So now when someone clicks the text and the link attached to that, it will take them directly to that other document.